folks, yes, you can find snakes in Poland. I found a dead one who was run over by a car. But yeah, there are snakes in Poland. And you, my kind viewer, please remember to subscribe, like and comment. Without you, it doesn't make sense. I'm in Poland again, yes, in Beskidi Mountains. You probably know where I am. If, if you have watched my previous vlogs, I'm in the spring. This healthy water is coming through. Uh, they call it salty water here. And it's got this organic material in it. It's very good for you. You can see the bubbles coming through. Well, anyway, I am in Poland. I went to Krakow and I'm going to Warsaw. So I hope you will join me and watch the vlogs. I've got my new lenses, new camera, so the quality should be crispy, crispy, clean. Have a look yourself. <clears throat> Welcome to my vlogs. Pozwólcie, że napiję się wody prosto ze źródła. Czuć te wajco? Parada. Time for a break. Of course, the water from the source, the spring. A bit smelly, egg. And you know the, the the smell of a cut wood, freshly cut wood, the raisin, what you call it, the ah, it's just wonderful. Hello, hello, and one more time hello, this is your inner voice. It's called Zupa. Welcome to Beskidi. Beskidi is a part of the Carpathian Range. Carpathian Range mountains uh, reach from Czech Republic through Poland, Slovakia. Hungary, Romania, down to Serbia is the second biggest range of mountains in Europe. It's not as high as Alps, but it's still a very significant one. I would say the main word for the uh, Carpathians is the spruce tree. The spruce tree is very, very common among all the Carpathians because when you, we're talking about Carpathian mountains, you have to know that they vary. They, 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 we get like peaks 2,500 meters high and we get, uh, but most of Carpathians will be like about 1,000 meters high. I don't actually know how much food it is. But anyway, what you see is Beskids. This is part of the Carpathians. The highest peak is Babia Gula at 1,725 meters and that's 5,700 feet. Those higher areas have alpine type habitat above the tree line and ski resorts. Lower down are extensive forests with bears, wolves and lakes. Gateway cities include Ostrava, Katowice and Kraków, while up the mountains are spot towns such as Nowy Szczyt. The best kids have been mined for coal and iron ore, but are mostly rural with many traditional wooden villages and churches. Tatras, Tatras are the highest mountains uh, in the Carpathians. They uh, look more like Alps, but the area is very small, especially on the Polish side. And you can only, it's, I don't know, it will be like 25 square kilometers or maybe, yeah, maximum of Tatras are actually in Poland. So if you want to explore Tatras, the highest mountains, I would recommend you to go to Slovakia, where most of the Tatra mountains are located. Most of the Carpathians are in Romania. It's like 70% and you have that uh, native uh, ancient woodland with uh, bears and wolves. Uh, and it's like 100 kilometers long stretch. Remember, you can get 10% off for stay in Beskide in the Osada Bura Polana cabins with Sona by saying uh, a keyword Zupa while booking and get 10% off. Have a look at the Osada Bura Polana, what it looks like. Uh, it's about uh, 100 kilometers from uh, an airport like Krakow or Katowice. Um, international, like intercontinental, would be Warsaw, probably the closest one, um, which is about five hours' drive away. 
place I'm showing you is actually a national park. This is why a lot of trees are preserved and not cut. When you look at the Slovakian side, you will see a lot of meadows, a lot of trees been cut. Gracias for watching this episode and I hope to see you on the next one. Till then, Vlogger Zupa. Brrr. Vlogger Zupa. Vlogger Zupa. There was a boy who was sincero. There was a boy who was sincero.